are certainly, uh, you know, clauses within our agreements that the provinces are expected uh, to meet, and there are consequences when they do not. The feds are calling out the Alberta government over differences with daycare operators regarding the implementation of the $10 a day affordable childcare program in the province. Ottawa says funding is there, but Alberta is not utilizing it. Particularly, I would say in Alberta, where last year they spent half of the funding that was allocated, that was sent to them uh, for this program, for, for the Canada-wide Early Learning and Child Care Program. So obviously, you know, the dollars are there. We have made a commitment uh, to all provinces and territories, and we expect to continue to work with them. An Alberta Daycare Operators Association says these blame games aren't going to solve the core issue. If the federal and the provincial governments can't stop playing ping pong of who's to blame, ultimately all that happens is impact upon parents, the parents that everybody in government is reflecting that they want to care about. And I feel like I would like to say to all levels of government, please work together cohesively in order to find solutions. Last week, the Association of Alberta Childcare Entrepreneurs had an in-depth meeting with Premier Daniel Smith to solve the differences in the implementation of the $10 a day federal daycare program in Alberta. Now they say they're waiting for Premier Smith's promised solutions. We have been contacted as an association by every single province in the country explaining to us that they are aligned with a lot of the concerns that we are highlighting, that they are seeing comparable situations in their provinces. And uh, there is very much uh, the possibility of an alliance at a national level relevant to this at what cost campaign. In Calgary, Hena Said, City News. In a statement sent to City News late Wednesday evening, the Alberta government provided a response to the concerns raised by Minister Suds regarding federal child care funding being left unspent, putting it all down to timing. It says, as the agreement was signed in November 2021, late in the fiscal year, only one quarter of the total funds for 21-22 were spent. Once the funding formula is fully implemented, the federal provincial child care agreement will be under funded and Alberta intends on using the carry forward to minimize the funding shortfall from the federal government. In addition to federal funding, Alberta's government has invested $786 million towards child care related initiatives since 2021.